dream team? Can you believe your teacher is here? Please. No. What is that? Oh, oh that's a hair bobble with peace on it. They all wear peace signs everywhere. Where did you get everywhere. that? Great Wolf Lodge in Florida. From what? Where in Florida, Abby? Well, well, when my mom went to Florida, she got it. And then the red one's from Great Wolf Lodge. Okay. That's, they're very cute. Okay, you very have cute. some questions for your I kids? I have some questions for your kids. My kids. My <laughs> kids. They're mine. Not yours. No, they're we'll yours. We'll share them, though. Okay. Okay, uh, girls, what is uh, what kind of activities did you to do in the Rock Our World project to promote peace with other classes? To teach others about peace, we read <coughs> peaceful stories to kids around the world, like Can You Say Peace? We also made movies about peace with kids around the world and showed them to classes around the world. We, we also showed one of our videos to the soldiers in Afghanistan who visited the class. That was pretty special when we you got did? to share that movie. Yeah, last week on our Remembrance Day, your memori Memorial Day, we did a video conference with um, our soldiers in Afghanistan. And we had created wow. we had created a movie with Ross Wallace from England, right. who was in Rock Our World, mm -hmm. and we shared that movie with our soldiers in Afghanistan. That is so cool. Yeah. That's really cool. Yeah. It was wow. very, it was very, wow. very cool. And we had veterans in our classroom as the movie was being broadcast to Afghanistan. Aww. It's very special. When I grow up, I want to be a teacher just like you. <laughs> you are. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have an awesome teacher. We just love her. Okay. Um, Okay, what is, when we're doing work like this, what is the best part of collaborating with other people when we're exploring topics like peace? The best part of collaborating with others while learning about peace is when we got to do animation is because it was fun to have the opportunity to be able to make comics with classes all around the world. And I also think it's better for us to get lots of ideas from different people than just to come from our own class. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. That is so true. Yeah. It's the power of many. Mm -hmm. That's exactly what it is with the teachers, too. Yep. Okay, and Summer, our last question is, if, if you could give advice to our world leaders about peace, what would you say to them? The message I would give to country decision makers about peace is that they need to stick together and never give up. They need to do what is best for the world. They should listen to their citizens who have good ideas. They should give money to peaceful projects, not war, because war is expensive and peace is priceless. That's awesome. Wow. Thanks, girls. Wow. Yeah. You really do have a dream team. We have you the really dream do. team. Absolutely. Uh, you girls are great. And we're so proud of everybody in Canada. And thank yeah. you, Carol Ann, for a great project. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks for coming. For co having me. <laughs>